Welcome to Geek's Corner, I'm Mr. Daps. And I'm Johnny Five. And why are you Johnny Five tonight? Because Friday, I sat down with a group of my friends and we made some boric acid polymer, which is a, uh, like a flubbery, rubbery, gooey, gacky substance that is based on the element boron, which is number five on the periodic table of the elements. Where is it? It's on the periodic table of the elements. No, 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 no. where's the flubber? You don't want to leave it in your trunk for too long. <laughs> Seriously? It melts. It, it goes away. Uh, but if, if you want to do it at home... I thought if you left it in your trunk, it made your car fly. No, 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 no. no. That's just Robin Williams. Uh, but if, if you want to learn how to make Wait, it... Wait, hold uh, on. Uh, Robin Williams did the remake. But who knows, in the comments, we'll see who gets it first. Oh. Who knows who originally invented Flubber and who was the actor that portrayed it? Mm -hmm. Make it a little interactive. It'll be fun. Yeah. Like Hopefully. It. Yeah. Do you know? Don't say it. But do you know? Oh, absolutely. Since I don't have to say it, he of course I know. He hasn't got a clue. So leave in the idea. comments who you, think, who you think it is. Name me the original guy that invented Flubber and um, the actor who portrayed and, him. And if you Google it, you're disqualified. We do have yeah, ways Yeah, we would like it. to see if, if you could do it on your own. Yeah. That'd be kind of so, cool. So, like, without leaving the video right now, type it into the comments. Don't even wait till the end. Just type it now. Yeah. Uh, but, but as I was going to say, if you want to learn how to make it, uh, it's it's basically like white glue, borax, and water, uh, but uh, it's all in flubber. Yeah, that's pretty much it. And you can fly the, the version we did, which is not copyrighted. It was with a pH and not an F. Uh, but oh, so it's not real flubber, so you don't yeah. really fly. Did it bounce pretty well? Or oh yeah, uh, two of the versions did, and one kind of splatted. Okay. Uh, but I'm uploading a video of it on a different channel, so I will link to that when it's when it's all up and you can see it. It'll be wonderful on the Johnny Five page. Yeah, right? I'll I'm link. Assuming? I'll link to it there, and I'll probably cool. put a link. Somewhere okay. in the comments here, if I can make a link comments. to another video. Yeah, YouTube. we like comments. Yeah. Um, speaking of comments, there was a noise behind us, sorry. Um, we're, we're a floor up. I don't think anything's going to sneak up from behind us. You never know. You never know. It's You never know. Yeah. I don't remember what I was going to say about comments. I don't remember either. Yeah. Let's go back to last week. Yeah. Uh, were there comments last week? There were a few comments. We, we said we were going to do a comment show, but I don't think we had enough for well, that. Well, it wasn't for this week, I don't yeah. think, because we didn't okay. have enough comments. But um, one of the comments was how excited they were that um, Ursula oh, yeah, that was Ursula's coming back to Fantasmic. Um, what was Friday? Uh, Friday was April 1st, I think. Yeah, so um, April Fool's. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, which... which we're sorry, because we did see how yeah. enthusiastic people got about it, but it was and one of those things, like, normally I can't sell that, and I felt like I could, so... Which, it, I think, is, is it one of the first times that you've done a live April Fool's I've never done a live video. April Fool's. Yeah. I always have to set them up, like, You're hiding behind, behind your, doors your printer. or something, yeah. so you can't see my face, because I'm a horrible liar. Mm -hmm. And, um... <laughs> we've now proven that you can successfully I accomplish I can do it that. occasionally. Yeah. yeah, I can do it and, occasionally. And if it's any consolation, I'm, I'm also really uh, disappointed that, that Ursula... It, it might be like we haven't heard a really rumor. Cool we we just made it up. If that happens, awesome. It would be awesome. If I loved happened. Ursula. The the it added that floating third Ursula. dimension Absolutely. of the show. Um, yeah, yeah. But, uh, but as far as we know, it's not actually happening. Same if goes. If you know anyone, same tell goes them. for the um, haunted mansion to uh, the Madame Leota's Revenge. Madame Leota's Revenge. Yeah, not, not yeah, an actual thing. Not really happening. That, there was a good article though. Uh, you can check it out on the news page if you would like to see what we're talking about. Mm -hmm. But, uh, yeah, that's... There is a new Haunted Mansion movie being made. Actually, it sounds really cool. But most of that was made up. There were a few elements of fact just to draw you give in. It, give it some mm -hmm. ver variability. Yeah. Um, ver variscosity. Yeah, so what else is going on? Um, we heard reports. Actually, we heard really awesome reports this weekend that John Lasseter was at Disneyland. Yes, yes he was. On Saturday and Sunday. In fact, somebody was at Napa Rose with John Lasseter. Well, he, and wait. apparently, they were talking about Geek's Corner. Yeah. Yep. And so, uh, so John Lasseter, we're waiting for if you. you. If you've heard of us, now you know what we are. We're I'm on Mr. Daps, Johnny Five. We're on mugs. Geek's Corner. See, yes. you can see it really good. Look at that. Amazing. And, uh, and, we're, and we've closed this spot a little more than usual, but we are still but keeping it open. this space is for you. We're protecting right. it so that we make sure that there's no... Right way. where East we meets West. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, also, while we were in the park on Sunday, you had the opportunity to go and see... 
Oh, I saw the uh, the pirates sneak peek. And you wrote a nice little blog about I it. Did. I yeah, did. So anyway, uh, tell me about it. Well, because I, I just think it's interesting that now movie trailers are becoming theme park attractions, mm -hmm. is basically what the blog was about. Um, so there's the Tron preview, uh, which is still going, mm -hmm. and now Tron's on DVD and Blu-ray. And Blu-ray, and 3D Blu-ray. And 3D Blu-ray. So you fact, can watch the entire movie. My review movie. is up now on Daps Magic News. Finally. <laughs> yeah, whatever. You know how many <laughs> extras are on that thing? I uh, believe it. There were lots. Um, and so... I, I, I like the pirates' experience better, mm -hmm. um, and and there there have been discussions about the actual trailer, how much it makes you want to see the movie. I'm I actually was really uh, really intrigued by the trailer. Uh, there there's something that Blackbeard I won't give it away for the people who haven't seen it, but there's something that Blackbeard does that I thought was a really fantastic ability for a pirate to have, uh, you know, because there's always that that element in there that that. So clearly, doing something it weird. did its job for you because yeah. now you want to see the it, movie. It did its job for me. Uh, Francis, I think, had a differing Francis, opinion. Francis, yeah, but uh, but I I was intrigued by it, and I thought that the uh, the thematic elements around the preview itself were were really a step in the right direction. So well done, Disney. Yeah. So I I still think that it's kind of a Could new have. thing that they're doing, and they mm -hmm. can go further with it. Mm -hmm. You know, like uh, for the Winnie the Pooh preview or I, I don't know the next big yeah, major epic. I don't epic. know where they could do Winnie the Pooh. Because Tron, Tron is epic and people have been waiting for it. Pirates you know what, is epic. You know what would be epic? Muppet movie. Yes. Well, it's and they called have The a Muppet Muppets. Theaters. And they have a Muppet yeah. theater. So, so if they um, can... John Lasseter, if you're listening to this, because you've got power. Yes. Um, after you come on our show... We can discuss some ideas. We can discuss ideas of how to promote The Muppets <laughs> new movie. I, w I want to see John Lasseter do a segment of if I was in charge because he kind of is <laughs> he is in charge so <laughs> maybe yeah it'd be awkward if so we it's did like, if he was in charge oh, wait a minute yeah. I am it'd be, yeah. a, it'd be a short segment it'd be funny though and we can't really do a segment no, that, no, no, that no. day because that'd be a little bit awkward yeah yeah, absolutely pitching ideas to the boss yeah right? mm -hmm. yeah that's how you get fired in one easy step right well we don't work for him so he can't fire us Oh, then let's do it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, like I said, why not? Now nah, we'll be considerate because it is John well, Lasseter. Absolutely. And he's yeah. awesome. And John is the best name in the world, so mm -hmm. got to have respect. Mm -hmm. I would be impressed if you came up with a five reason for John Lasseter to be on our show. Next week? Maybe that's for next week. Yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Without skipping a beat, that's next week. <laughs> that's quite impressive. Because it'll be our 28th episode, two and eight is ten, so you'll have a reason why I'm Johnny Five, plus five reasons for John Lasseter. So it'll be ten total. Okay, you lost me, but total good. You you know what I meant. Mm -hmm. um, talk about pirates. I believe it's May seventh. The pirates premiere will be happening at Disneyland, and they're gonna have a black carpet this year. Um, they've done it for the last two pirates movies, and they're pretty cool. We had uh, people representing Daps at both of them. Uh, um, funny story. One of the times they were doing that, and they had the big screen up on on mm -hmm. the island. Yeah, um, I was walking Both by. Both times, actually, but yeah. Well, just I don't remember which one it was, mm -hmm. but I was walking by and I saw the the big screen, and mm -hmm. they were testing it, and making sure that the projector was lined yeah, up and all that's that. Yeah, that's a good thing to do. Um, and they were playing pong on it, so just walking <laughs> around. There's this giant pong game, and like there's nothing, there's no hiding it. It's just we're playing pong to make sure everything's lined up correctly and the awesome. colors are right. <laughs> you go, yeah, yeah. Which brings up an interesting point that if you're in the park that weekend. It's going to be a little bit different. It's probably going to be a little bit crazy there. Yeah. Um, so if you don't go a lot and you want to see a lot of stuff, it's probably not your best weekend to hang out at Disneyland. Don't just they, because it's going to be a little crazy. early? Or just probably. that land or they something? They usually... Yeah. They, yeah, they did last time, and I think they kept uh, DCA, Disney California Adventure, open later. Yeah. So we'll, I'm assuming they'll do the same thing, and um, we will do our best to keep you updated on that. I'm sure that'll be on DNN. That's, that's information. Absolutely. Yeah. It'll be on every news source we have, so... Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All three of them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you know, so, that's okay. Yeah. Um, one other group that's affiliated with it, with us is uh, Tales from the Mouse House. Okay. You have no clue what I'm talking about. <laughs> well, clearly Alan it's... Joyce. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay, yeah. Okay. See, so I, I know the names, the I don't know yeah. what they're... Yeah. Um, so they did a really nice... Uh, Chat? Podcast? Podcast? <laughs> yeah, it's a podcast. That's the name of it. It's, you just said it like yeah, a second ago. I know. They gave a really nice uh, nod to Egon Bonkers yeah. um, on their podcast, so check them out, and we'll probably have like a little thing there with the name so you can see where it is and find it, and uh, definitely check them out. They've got a lot of cool stuff going on mm -hmm. over there, and uh, other cool things going on with Geek's Corner. We have a guy that likes to write about Epcot, so if you like oh, yeah. Epcot, 
check out the writings of Journey into My Imagination. Yes. Um, he posted an awesome thing there just recently, and um, I enjoyed reading it. He's had two articles for us so far, and we hope many, Which many more. More than one. So. Yeah, how many have you done? I have more than one also. I did the one today, and I did, I yeah, think, did one or two a couple, couple, other, couple okay. months ago. Yeah. 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 So check those out. Yeah. Um, what else is going on? I'm sure plenty. Hmm. No magic trick tonight, I guess. No, huh? no magic trick. Uh, I've been I've been advised against them for the time being. So I think I think you posted a couple pictures of uh, attempts at magic in the parks. I did. I think, didn't you? Of a uh, maybe Johnny plus thirteen feet of rope is magic or something. I don't know. I thought no, it was I on Twitter or something. That wasn't me. No. Oh. No. Okay, I need to track that down then. Maybe maybe one of our uh, Sunday sweeper crew did sweeper maybe. Sunday crew. Um, so if you assumed it if you are in the park on Sunday nights, by the way, yes. and you want to find us and ride the sweeper train for us, just uh, watch the hashtag, hashtag sweeper Sunday. Because last week there were only five of us. Yeah, and we need more than that. Yeah, yeah. Are, do we do we want to talk about our goal now or? Uh, we'll do it another time. We'll save moment. it. Okay, we'll, yeah. we'll save it for we next time. We have a goal. We're not going to tell you what it is now. We'll tell you soon. But we do have a goal. And yeah. We just want more people. We'll yeah. start with yeah. yeah. We'll, we'll start, we'll start with, with, with gaining that momentum. Bring your friends. We love friends. Mm -hmm. They're good. Yeah. And uh, the more the merrier. Yeah. It's a lot of fun. It's a big train, so we can fit lots. And, Absolutely. Uh, it's the party train. Yeah. And it really the best is. part, the best part, I think, every week, is when we get to Small World and we're going past yeah. Small World, and there's <laughs> the same two custodial guys every week waving at us. So if you're watching us, uh, that the, that's us. You tall Hi. guy. It's the tall guy and the shorter guy too, which makes it even better. Yeah. Because it's just kind of like that. So yeah. leave leave comments and identify yourself. Yeah, because we, we really do. We appreciate you. Yeah, we yeah, enjoy yeah. your waves every week. The, so. the the custodians are really like the eyes and ears of the park. Mm -hmm. I think they're they're really the. I mean, they, they like the the Disney spies of the park. I, I say like, so. Yeah. Did, I mean, we do have custodial ninja. Yeah. He used to he used to work in custodial, and he can get around and find out everything. So yeah. exactly, yeah. those mops had cameras in. Mm -hmm. It's true. Yeah. yeah. Well, now we're going over on time. Oh, okay. Well. So we do need to wrap things up. <laughs> I guess. Um, if you leave enough comments, we will do a comment uh, show next week. But should we put a number on it? Like, we need at least 50? 50? We, really? Well, we need if stuff to talk about. If we're going through each one individually. Like, we need 10 we good go, ones. We need you 10. Know, we need topics yeah. in comments or something. Like, yeah, we don't so, really know so how we're going to do a comment show. So if you make it enough that we can fill a whole show, yeah, we'll aim for 30 to 50. Yeah. Um, you guys got to 25 once. So no hey. problem. Yeah. yeah, so if you get enough people going for it, awesome. And yeah. we will do that whenever we get to that point. And that's all the time we have this week, so we will see you around the corner. Geek out! <laughs>